137 million? Yes, and if I don't pay up, I'll go to jail for tax evasion. <laughs> I'm crazy enough to take on Batman, but the IRS, no, thank you. Hello, and welcome to James the Lesser Express Line, where we get you now as fast as possible with dollar earn. There's a dollar you can spend right away, guys. Why would you save any money? Oh, let's listen. Dude, these people are nuts. They think, dude, what is this? This childlike mentality. Well, a dollar made is a dollar you can spend. <laughs> On what planet? On what planet do you make a dollar and you don't have to pay anything? The real world? Gee, this bill's $200. I get my paycheck. Oh, hey, I still got over $300 left. Yay, I can spend it on something else. Like another bill, but not always. I just bought a foldable kayak. And oh, hey, my friends want to go out and do something? But guess what? I can go out and do that. Or, oh, hey, Super Bowl, do you guys need to bring anything? Oh, yeah, if you can bring... Uh, this, this, and this. All right, stop at a store on my way home, grab the stuff that they want, then bring it to them. I can do that. You know why? Because a dollar earned is not a dollar spent. A dollar earned is a dollar that you can save up until, hey, I want this. Hey, let's go do that. Are you out of your mind? Maybe if, maybe if you're an 18-year-old kid who still is with his parents, and he's got his first job, right? And he fucking is making money. All oh, that money's for me. Yeah, maybe for you, kid. But adults have fucking lives and responsibilities. When they make money, it goes to things around them. And that's what's happened to me over the years is money just gets pissed away on this and that. And... Now, I've never heard the saying pissed away on this and that on essentials. I didn't piss away my paycheck on my mortgage. I didn't piss away my paycheck on my electric bill. I did piss it away on a portable kayak. But then again, I don't have the bag. I can just go back to work. And then earn another paycheck. You know, now I'm in a situation where, you know, I've got, you know, a lot of times things are tight financially because of bills and, and back back things that I owe and that I'm still trying to get caught up on. And every Back taxes. We know about those. Every single time one of these things happens where someone tries to screw me over with money, right? False copyright strikes. Uh, you know. Those were years and years and years ago. If those are still fucking you over, DSP, what the hell? Screw with my identity theft and screw with my financials. There was no identity theft. There was absolutely zero identity theft. There was. DSP's an idiot. Probably use the same password for everything. Oh, hey, look at that. And isn't it second form of whatever? So I'll just type in password used on everything. Hey, look at that. Gets right into his bank account. Look at that. He spent this much on his mortgage. He spent five hundred dollars more than that on Apple iTunes cards. That's not identity theft. That's just you being an idiot and spending all your money on WWE champions. And shit. And all my arrangements for payments and things get screwed up. And that you know, it just every time I try to get to a point where I'm good, I get screwed over again by someone else or something else. You know. So I'm working on it, but I'm not there yet. But maybe soon. I guess we'll see. Take a sip of that gin. When he drinks out of the seltzer bottle, that's seltzer water. Drinks out of the water bottle, that's when he gin or some other alcohol. Why would you have two different bottles filled with water? Anyways, I just love that a dollar earned is a dollar you can spend on bills and just piss it away. Yeah, on WWE Champions DSP. We saw the bank leaks. We know you literally spend more on WWE Champions than you do on your mortgage. I just not understand making over $10,000 a month and being strapped for cash. Unless you're an addict who's addicted to WWE Champions, which you are. But with that, I'm going to let you guys go. Thank you for watching. As always, like, subscribe, comment down below, and have one hell of a day.